The fire departments for Terrace and Thornhill took part in a training session this weekend that focused on how to manage propane fires. The event was organized by Emergency Response Assistance Canada and funded by Alta Gas, which operates a propane export terminal in Prince Rupert. The training session focused primarily on fires from larger vessels, such as rail cars. But Terrace Deputy Fire Chief Dave Jeffson says it can also help them with all sorts of propane fires. He says the department regularly deals with fires connected to propane tanks on people's sun decks, and with propane fires, it's not as easy as just shooting water at the flames. We still go to the propane, 20 pound propane cylinders on people's sun decks. If that's venting and shooshing out, you know, that's a lot of fire. That's intimidating, that can cause a lot of damage. So having that basic knowledge, the firefighters know they, how to know how to engage the situation, how to protect themselves. They know to turn the valve off rather than put the fire out. If they put the fire out, now all of a sudden you have this leaking gas. We want to try to prevent leaking gas. Alta Gas Senior Vice President for External Affairs, Dan Wozno, says this event is just one of many training sessions the company hopes to hold with fire departments along the railroad. So when, when we talk to the communities along the corridor, I mean, one of the biggest things is they have budgets for firefighting and so forth, but they don't have a lot of budgets for training. And so by us being able to sponsor things like bringing in the propane and meals and so forth for people for training, the fire departments want to be trained. And the training that they do here doesn't just help with propane fires potentially around rail cars. It also helps for propane propane files in RVs and backyards, which is what the fire chief was just explaining to me. This just gets that confidence. A few local politicians made appearances at the event as well. It, it, it's a comfort thing, it's a safety thing for our community to know that our fire department is, is where they need to be. They're up to date, they're trained. So it's nice to see companies like uh, Superior Propane and CN and Altgas actually footing the bill for this type of training. This should be happening all across BC. For CFTK TV News, I'm Joshua Azizi.